Emergency rooms are experiencing an influx of people, not only because of COVID-19, but for normal visits as well. News 4 Tucson's Austin Walker shows us if long lines and wait times are reality here in Pima County. Just because we're in a pandemic doesn't mean the normal trips to an urgent care stop. I spoke with one woman who said she was pleasantly surprised by her visit. When I was signed in and got a text message stating that I was number 60 on the waiting list. Karen Garcia was expecting to wait an eternity when she went to a next care clinic for a normal visit. And when I got there, the parking lot was full. But instead, it was the opposite. Within 15 minutes, I was down to being the first one and I was seen right away. Uh, some of our clinics are seeing up to 150 patients a day. Dr. Richard Fleming, the spokesperson for the next care system in Pima County, says just because COVID-19 is prevalent does not mean normal visits are overlooked. And we're still seeing those patients. We just have them going through a separate entrance. They are not being pushed back. Um, if they come in, they will be seen. Garcia says urgent cares around Pima County are stepping up. Uh, providing safe and efficient uh, health care to the people who need it. So far so good today. I wanted to see how long wait times were at all emergency rooms in Tucson. I called and asked if I had a broken leg, how long would it take to be seen? At around noon on Monday, all Tucson ERs had no more than five people waiting in line. I also reached out to a couple next care clinics, but I never heard back. Dr. Fleming also told me they have increased all of their staff at every one of their facilities here in Pima County. And if you're looking to avoid that terrible hold music, you can make an appointment on your phone. We've got you covered. I'm Austin Walker, News 4, Tucson.